geomagnetic storm from sun to hit earth migratory birds satellites most vulnerable a coronal mass ejection from the sun is on its way to the inner planets traveling at speeds of over millions of kilometers per hour and is likely to impact earth the plasma participle from sun is likely to trigger a geomagnetic storm on the planet that could affect radio waves the coronal mass ejection emerged from reverse polarity sunspot ar3296 on may 7 cmes are massive bursts of plasma and magnetic fields that are released from the sun's corona the corona is the outermost layer of the sun atmosphere and it is made up of extremely hot plasma that is constantly in motion. When a coronal mass ejection is released, it sends billions of tons of charged particles hurtling into space at incredible speeds. These particles can travel at up to 3 million kilometers per hour and if they are aimed in the direction of the earth they can cause all shots of effects when they arrive the u.s based space weather prediction center forecasted that the May 7, CME could trigger a G1 class minor geomagnetic storm on Earth as it hits the planet's magnetic field. The event could cause weak power grid fluctuation and a minor impact on satellite operation is also possible. Geomagnetic storms are caused by the interaction between the CME's magnetic field and Earth's magnetic field. When these magnetic fields collide, they can cause a rapid fluctuation in Earth's magnetic field, which can create electrical currents in the ionosphere in the Earth's surface. These electrical currents can disrupt satellite communication and power grids as well as create aurors in the polar regions. The geomagnetic storm could continue on Thursday as well with migratory animals likely being affected at higher levels. An order of visible at high latitude is worth mentioning that migratory birds use Earth's magnetic field for their navigation requirements. Earth was recently hit by a major bout of geomagnetic storms that triggered auroras at even low altitudes. The mysterious phenomenon was observed in Ladakh as well and was picked up by the Indian Astronomical Observatory. NASA has said that the Sun is peaking in its solar cycle and heading for solar maximum leading to rampant activity. Last week, the Sun exploded with 40 notable solar flares and 31 coronal mass injections most of which were not directed towards Earth.